What's up, guys? It's King Daddy DMAC, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved! Woohoo! Super excited, super excited here on the Poop and Evolve server. I said it right! I said it right this time. Jump see poop! So excited. How's everybody doing? Everybody doing good? I am doing fantastic. You know why. Do you guys know why? You should know why, because you guys are the reason. We just hit over 300,000 subscribers on the channel. I am super pumped about that, super pumped. Thank you guys so very much, so very much for all your support, for subscribing to the channel, for watching the videos, for hitting those thumbs up. It's amazing, and we got there. Now, I don't know what I'm going to be doing for my special yet. I don't know if I'm going to have a special. I don't know. I want to know what you guys would like to see. Would you like me to do something? Maybe with a face cam, maybe with streaming, maybe with just something special in the episode. I don't know. I also don't know if it's going to be, if it should be an ARC thing, because the channel's not only ARC. It's, it's, it started off with Pokemon, then it went into Minecraft, and now doing a lot of ARC. And I don't want a lot of you guys, I don't want you to think that Ark is the only thing that we're ever going to do from now on. It just happens to be the game that we're doing right now. Right now, and it's hard to do a lot of survival games, but in any case, thank you so much, and I appreciate every one of you, whether you're here for this, for something else, for whatever. It's awesome. It's so cool hanging out and sharing my world, my experiences with you all. So give yourselves a pat on the back. It's so crazy, though. I cannot believe it. Um, last episode, we, we did a whole bunch of building, a whole bunch of breeding, and all sorts of stuff like that, and I think we're going to continue on with it. Just wanted to let you know, for the last two days, I've been breeding like crazy, like a madman, getting all sorts of new Spinos, new Argies, lots of new stuff. Eat, eat. But I just actually got something really good today. I was able to pass over, I think it's five... Five of the seven stats, maybe four of the seven stats over to this beautiful green spino right here, which is pretty cool. I'm just naming them all based on the level thus far, but they're growing up. And today I also have been breeding a lot of RGs. And let me see. There's one right here that's in particular pretty good. We got 3,000 stamina with over 2,000 health. It's pretty cool. So breeding is pretty tough. It's pretty grindy and it's it's hard. It's real hard. It takes a long time. Definitely, definitely still needs a lot of work done to it, but I'm getting the hang of it, and I think I'm starting to do pretty well, but I've had so many duds. In fact, you can see a lot of our Rexes are missing. A lot of our other Dinos are missing. It's because it was getting so laggy at my base, I had to move them. Checky this out. Ooh, they're not in line anymore. That means they were attacking something. Yes, I moved over a ton of our Rexes, some dud Spinos, dud... All sorts of stuff and they're not duds they're just not worthy of being in the base right now so we're gonna start to eventually set up an area over here a big old pen for just putting all of our extra stuff maybe turn it into like a kibble farm or something what's going on over here what's the shenanigans going on you guys let's just tear this stuff up because there is too much going on that's scary get out of here <laughs> In any case, um, I'm heading over to the snow biome right now because we are a bit short on uh, polymer. I want to get some organic polymer. I want to be able to build the behemoth gates out of metal. Yes, metal, which takes over 100 polymer or 100 polymer to be able to craft just for one of them. So it's pretty nuts. We should have everything else. But why don't we get a going on that? Ooh, look at all those quetzes over at those. Getting a lot, buddy. Moving up in the world. But yes, I'll see you back at the base once we got the polymer. Oh my god, look at this. I've never seen this before. That's a blue mammoth. That can't be blue. Is it blue? Is this a new color that I've just never seen before? That's freaking awesome. It's like blue and red. Oh, I almost feel like I want to breed with it. I want to get it for the color. I I don't know if I've just never noticed that color or if that's a new color or what. Guys, Blue Mammoth, is that something unusual? Is that something you normally don't see? What do we have over here? 24, 4. Yeah, I've never seen a blue. Maybe it's just because it's in the sun, but either way, 
we've got everything that we need. We got all of the polymer that we need. Grabbing just some oil and some last minute things. I think we're gonna grab this mammoth. We're gonna take it over. I don't know. Maybe we'll tame it. Just, just for the color. I mean, that would be awesome to get a blue mammoth to go with a blue dodic. Please, you gotta have that. So in any case, we're doing well. We're passing by BTC's winter base. I think everything pretty cool. Let's head home. Let's get this mammoth gate or behemoth gate done up. That's awesome, blue mammoth. For realsies, never seen that. Next, you're gonna tell me there's blue argies. All right, guys, we're back home and the mammoth is still blue, looking bluer than ever. It's crazy town. Absolutely nuts. All right, is that gonna get it? Got it, got it. All right, hopefully he can't walk up that. I don't think that he can. So we'll see, we'll tame him a little bit. More importantly, actually, let's bring this in here. We need to get all this polymer all set for the smithy. So let's bring this in. We need to get doors on our place. It's so bad that we don't have doors. All right, so we have everything all set in there. Behemoth Gate needs 100 polymer, and I've got, notice, 3,000 metal. That's enough so that we can get both the gate and the door. 700 cementing paste for both the gate and the door. Let's dump out our inventory all into this guy, and we're gonna need 10 stacks. All right, so here we go. 10 stacks, let's do this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I think that's more than 10. That's actually 11, but that's okay. Let's get that all in here. And let's go craft item and craft item. Nice. <laughs> let's look at this thing. Let's look at how gargantuan it is. Oh, that is cool looking. Look at that monster. Oh man, it's awesome. So I'm thinking I'm gonna put it out right maybe about like there, something like that, just since we have a little bit more room. So I'm gonna play around with it and I'll set it in with you once I got it all measured out. I think that should be pretty cool. And should we do that first or should we tame? Maybe we should down the mammoth first. So let me get all my stuff ready. We'll be right back. All right, finishing cooking up the kibble. It's so funny. I'm so used to only taming 120s, 116s that it didn't even occur to me that this isn't a perfect tame. There's really not a need for kibble. But hey, what are you gonna do? It's still a mammoth. It's still something. Oh man, it had to get dark out right when we did this. Why, guy? Why are you gonna get dark? All right, hopefully he does not aggro everybody else. I put all the spinos on passive. We shall see. This is such the perfect taming pen for a mammoth. Right in the face. Yes, we got him. We got him. Kibble tamed him. I know I didn't need to. A uh, blue boy. For now. Oh, awesome. So, stats, nothing incredible. Nothing crazy, but it's a blue mammoth. I would think that someone colored this guy. Like, seriously. How are we going to get out of here is the better question. This is the better question, because you st <laughs> You jerk! Alright, let's get him to unfollow, let's get him to wander. And hopefully he'll wander- yep, 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 yep. Perfect! Alright, can we unwander you? Disable wander, awesome! So let's get this guy a super cool saddle. Let's see if we have any females that we can breed with. That would be awesome. We've got our RGs just about finishing up. Our Spinos are in the Juvenile. 
stage, not bad. Doing well, eating out of the feeding trough. Where were we? What were we doing? Saddle. That's right. Saddle. I know I got a pretty good mammoth saddle. Let's -a see. Let's -a see for ourselves. Mammoth. Oh, oh, there it is. There it is. 38. Is that the best one we have? Ooh, 40, 40, 40, 40. All right, I like that one. Oh, you are awesome looking. Totally awesome looking. Even awesomer. Look at that. Oh, it's great. You don't even have to color it. It's perfect. Oh, it's so awesome. And I'll tell you, it's not bad. Like, the stats aren't great, but they're not bad. It almost looks like a raptor's stats. But we'll make it better. We'll make it way better. And I like it. It's like blue and red. All right, so what do we have for female mammoths? Unfortunately, the Hulk is a male. Of course it's a male. We got male. Donovan is a male. What about you, Ebony? Female. Perfect. Why don't we just do a quick breed? I've never seen a pregnant mammoth before. So Ebony, you know Ebony. Ebony's from last season, one of the ones we brought over. Let's do a quick breed. Let's go to you, enable wander, enable wander. Let's spam that you. Oh, oh. Now it is cool is it is a boy. So we can just spam breed with all the females. All the females. I think it's supposed to go the other way around. Kind of dirty, Ebony. <laughs> nice. All right. So it's got the gestation process going. These two can just hang out. We'll see what's up. Let's move Ebony a little bit closer to while we're working. Ooh, we got a level up. <gasps> level up. Bam. Ebony is now a level 200. Super sweet. You know what? I, who else is the level 200? And I've been waiting. I've been waiting to share with you. That's right. The Hulk. The Hulk's got to level up too. The Hulk is finally level 200. Ooh, 201, 202, 203. <gasps> 203. You're crazy, Hulk. You are crazy. <laughs> All right, awesome. So we'll see what this mammoth ends up looking like as it gets pregnant. It already looks like it's got a bigger belly. The belly kind of wiggly. Oh man, I've never seen a baby mammoth before, so that'll be pretty cool. Yeah, looks like it's gonna take a while. All right, Ebony's doing well, over halfway done. Over halfway done, I went ahead, I crafted up a second behemoth gate and door. So super expensive, we're getting pretty low on metal now, getting pretty low. One last thing I wanna do while we have the organic polymer here Let's go ahead. Let's take it all. We should have over 120 left, which should allow us to craft up two more safes. So let's go ahead and throw it all in there. Nice. And let's go turn on safe two. Nice. Oh, man. Look at that big old baby bump. That belly is humongous. Oh my goodness, look at it. It's crazy, it almost touches the ground. You are so pregnant. Did it come already? No, there it is. Oh, and it's blue, and it's awesome. Look at the baby. All right, let's hurry up, let's imprint, accept. Let's give it some food. It can only take a couple. Look at the cute little baby. Disable Wander, it's adorable. Oh, you're so adorable. Oh, I'm so happy that we did this. It's a level 125 as well. Oh, it's nuts. All right, let's move the mama. Move the mama. 
Come here, baby. Come here, baby. No, this way. This way, baby. Oh, no, you're supposed to be following me. Right? Yeah, you're supposed to be following me. Come on. Oh, that is not bad. We got the blue and we got a decent level for the blue. I was expecting so much lower. All right, let's get that food in. It doesn't have huge weight to begin with. Oh, it's so cute. Look at the derpiness. Look at, <laughs> Look at that mouth. Why are you so derpy? Oh, it's adorable. Oh, you so cute. It's like little shaky. I love it so much. It's so derpy looking though. All right, the baby is now a juvenile. Yay. It doesn't look quite as messed up, but it's funny. It's horns. They're so goofy looking. I don't know, maybe it's, or it could be the trunk. It's just so weird, they made him so much bigger than what the mammoth is. He's got such a big head. He's crazy, I mean, just look at this. Look at us, look at him. He's such a weirdo, bro. <laughs> and the hitbox is atrocious on it. It's so cool, though. Let me see if I can get a screenshot from this side of it. What's that look like? Yes! It's so weird. You're so derpy, bro. Look at his... Like, in his mouth. Look at that. He's just got, like, this weird grin on his face. Definitely still needs some work, but it's cool. I do like it. A lot of the babies look pretty weird. But, hey, what are you going to do? It's still cool. It's very cool. So anyway, I can just leave everything in the feeding trough now. Nice. And I'm so happy we got that color. And it's nice. We got, like, really pearly white tusks. So it's pretty cool. Not bad. We'll have to do another breed with it. Anyway, I'm laying in more foundations. Doing a whole bunch of work. Um, Let's see here. Get rid of all this wood. Schwammy. We need a lot more metal, though. So, after that metal montage from last episode, it just kind of cleaned me out. That and those gates are just ungodly expensive. We're getting it filled in little by little. Little by little. I think it's cool. How many more? We got 12 more left. That was weird. It plays funny. And... Shwam. 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 Ooh, I see spino egg. Two spino eggs! Sweet. Looking good, guys. Looking good. Our spinos are just about finished, too. Which is pretty cool. Let's see. See, I'm not sure how far. A lot of the stone we're going to end up probably ripping out and replacing with metal in the future. And right here, I haven't put anything in yet because it's probably going to be all metal as well. But we'll see. Adolescent, you guys almost done? Man, they're only like halfway done. I do think it's time, though, that you get out of the house. Because you're taking up too much space. This is the really good one. Look at you, you're just like all green. You both following? Following? Okay. Let's get these guys out of here. Oh man, so it's much bigger. I think it's getting close to the adolescent stage. But it's still got that goofy smile. What's up with you, bro? It's so hilarious. Like, the other mammoths don't have that. They definitely don't have that. Your lip just doesn't come down enough, bro. You look so scary. Oh, and so doing well. Got most of this all filled down in with stone, which is cool. I think I'm about to go for a metal run. But maybe, I don't know. There's a lot to get done today. A real lot. 
We'll see. I think I'm going to get all strapped up. In case we run into anything while going around the mountain looking for metal, I don't know. I'd really like to get a gig today. That would be sweet. All right, guys, getting ready to make some giga kibble and getting everything all set. More quats eggs. Need those quats eggs. That's right, because that's what the giga eats. All right, let's just run up here. We're going to make some narcotics real quick just so we can get plenty of darts for our dart gun. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Five. Throw some extra in there. Some extra in there. Take that out. Let's get plenty of that rotten meat. Wham, 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 wham. All right, cool. So a whole bunch of narcotics. Ooh, I see spino egg. Spino egg. All right. So drugs, narcotics, shwam, shwam. And bam, bam. Got it. Sweet. So another 200 buckets of narcotics. Not bad. Let's grab these spino eggs. Spino eggs are used for megalodons, by the way. Something we could have used previously, but it's okay. We're doing good. The little baby mammoth's doing okay. Let's check him out. Oh, you're doing so good, buddy. He's a juvenile still. These guys take forever. But that saddle's looking pretty spiffy, buddy. All right. Let's get the Hulk in. Now, these Quetzal eggs, they require three rock carrots, three of the meat jerkies, prime meat jerkies, but then a hundred major berries and an absurd amount of fiber, like 125 or something like that. Something ridiculous. So let's run on over here. Let's get a whole bunch of fiber. How you doing, buddy? You got the fiber? You got the fiber for me. Let's get all the fiber, and we're gonna make up a ton of these eggs. Now it would be it would be way more convenient if we set down our industrial cooking pot, but we're still not ready. It's so expensive. I don't want to set it down until I know it's exactly where I want it to be. I'll wait till the next update, which should be out already, but it's not out right now as I'm playing. All right, so. So, 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 let's get this ready. We have 60 Quetz eggs. Um, I'm gonna get probably 20 of them made up. So that's gonna be shwam, bam, 20. Oh, and will we have enough rock carrots? Actually, we're gonna need 60. Holy crud. We want that. We need 60 prime meats. Good lord. So let's get this all set up. Oh man, I'm just gonna have to babysit this to the max. So 10 is gonna be 30. Yikes, guys. Super yikes. So there we go. And then we need three of the rocks. So 60 of the carrots, too. Lordy lord. All right, let's grab that out. Let's put the fiber in. And I'm gonna have to keep on bumping all this stuff up. All right, am I ready? Oh, and the Majos, too. I just went out on the Hulk, so we got a whole bunch of Majos. Hopefully that'll be enough. We'll just stop it if it isn't. We also got a couple more in there. All right, so good enough. Let's get out the carrots. Let's-a go. I'm curious if I can owe this out. I don't think I can. All right, whatevs. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Oh, lordy. All right, half there. Half there, and the berries. Bam, bam. Oh, this is going to be stressful. Let's get that. Oh, oh, let's go there, and then there, and then light fire. And then what do we need there? light fire all right so let's see if we get our kibble let's see if this works
We're going to have to add in more carrots, but they spoil so quickly. Look at that. Only a minute. Yes! Quetzal kibble. Perfect. All right. Um, oh, let's get this stuff all in there. Got to get the berries again. Oh, this is stressful. I really could use that industrial cooking pot. Really, really, really. All right, so let's grab that out. Let's throw the berries in. Quick, quick, quick. Take that out. We'll take that out. Throw the berries in. Throw the fiber in. Holy! All right, guys. Got all the kibble made up. Oh, it's going to be nuts. Let me show you what I got prepped. Let me show you. So I got an extra canteen. We got 20 kibble, which should be more than enough. Check out all the darts. 100, 200, 324 darts, plus another, I don't know, 400, 250 arrows, something like that. Tons of narcotics. We're going for it, man. We are going for it. So I'm just gonna do one last little check, see if there's anything else we need. This Quetz has tons of weight left. So if we need to bring more, we can. We just got to remember if we die while doing this, we're going to lose everything. So I might as well, might as well grab all the narcotics. We're going to be able to just sit there and chill on it. So we're not going to have to worry about anything else with the kibble. Oh, is there anything else? I think we're good. I'm going to, I'm going to start hunting. I am going to start hunting the mammoth. Gorgeous blue. Still got the derpy face. But it's doing well. It's getting there. It's still only probably about halfway. A little over halfway. So that's cool. But in the final stage. So in any case, yes. Let's go. Stop laying so many eggs, guys. <laughs> let's go out and let's find this sucker. See where a oh where is a giga. Oh man, you know what guys? We are just about out of time. I decided I'm going to save the Giga Hunt for next episode just so that we can dedicate enough time to do this proper. It takes a long time to tame a Giga and also to go hunting for one. I've already been out for over an hour and I haven't been able to find, find one that I like. But I promise you next episode, we're going to get a good one. That's right. Only the best for you. So thanks for watching. Hit those thumbs up. And thank you guys for the 300,000 subscribers. Oh man, it's amazing. I love it. Don't forget, let me know what you'd like to see, if we'd like to see a special, and if so, what you'd like me to do for it. That's right. Later, guys. Peace out.